some of y'all were sounding off after we talked about where to take your complaints about excessive speeding in your neighborhoods or on your commute. Mm, let's see. Look at Miss Carla. She wrote in from Fort Worth about an intersection near a school where she says people pass by so quickly sometimes the noise startles her. Carla, here's what you can do. The city of Fort Worth takes what they call traffic calming requests by phone or email. If that doesn't help, reach out to your local elected officials. Over in Dallas, Karen shared concerns over drivers trying to beat the train at the crossing on Centerville Road. She says she wants to see speed bumps installed after watching people fly through that interview intersection. That's also what Marisol is worried about between Pembroke and Clarendon in Dallas, where she says cars are zooming down the road with no stops or speed bumps in those four blocks. Now y'all can submit a traffic speed control service request through 311 or the city's app Our Dallas. And something we love to see, Summer is organizing her neighbors in East Dallas over what she says is a serious issue in Lakewood. Now she says she wants city officials to do something about the increase in traffic from construction at Garland, Gaston and Grand, as well as its impact. Now that's something we've mentioned to you on Daybreak before. Loveland says people are using Lothar as a detour to get to and from Mockingbird as well as Gaston. And as they do, they are ignoring a stop sign where Lothar meets Lakewood. Now this is near a major pedestrian and biker entrance to the White Rock Lake Trail. Good luck, Summer. Keep us posted on any action. Keep them coming, y'all. And please, if you want to see some change in your neighborhood, get loud about it. It could save lives. For now, I'm Tashara Parker. You can follow me all over while I'm always asking you to talk traffic to me.